Empty seats were being filled on Wednesday as the Student Government Association held their vacancy Senate elections. With over 40 candidates to choose from, students had to narrow their list down to five senators at large and one senator to represent the College of Communication and Fine Arts. Senator at large Deronda Wilkins explains the reason behind this semester's vacancy election. After fall semester is over, we end up having like students who end up graduating or some who like have, they have other responsibilities that they have to take on. So then we have to have a, hold a vacancy election. The vacancy election gave students the opportunity to exercise their right to vote. And for one student, Wednesday's vacancy election was all about seeing new faces. There are so many different um, types of people that have been running for these offices. So I would love to see new faces and see how people can impact our university in major ways. So um, I came out today to let other people have the opportunity to let their voices be heard just as well as others. And Kier isn't the only student concerned with promoting diversity and ensuring that every student's voice is heard. These ideas are already being encouraged by current SGA members and are expected only to grow with the next group of senators. It's important for them to know that we do care about their input and it's also important for like the, us to show the student, the student body as whole as well as the university that we do want to be represented. We do want to have diversity by them coming to vote. It creates diversity in our student government and also it gives like anybody who doesn't feel like they had the opportunity early in fall semester to have a say. Results from the vacancy election will be posted on the Troy SGA Twitter page once the polls have closed. Sarah Singletary, Troy, Trojan Vision News.